Welcome to Ukenic. In this video, we're going to show you how to test a Mercedes alternator to see if it's charging or not. Uh, here we have a, a voltmeter. Uh, what you want to do is you want to turn this on and put it on the settings V with a straight line and dots on the bottom. That's a DC uh, voltage. So that's where you want to be. Uh, the other setting is for AC voltage, so you don't want to be there. If, uh, if you have to select a range, this is auto sensing, uh, but if you have to select a range, typically it will say 20, so put it on 20, 20, 100, 200, you want to be on 20. So in this case here, what we're going to do is we're going to connect these terminals. You connect one to the positive over here and one to the ground. Ground is right here, but you can use any other bolts. Um, so we'll connect to the ground. That's not holding there. And here's the positive. Now if you have the battery uh, here accessible, of course you can connect directly to the battery, but uh, since we don't, I'm, uh, this is not holding on the negative here, so I'm just gonna use one of the bolts there. And we should be getting 12 volts. You can see 12.6 almost. Now when we start the engine, this should jump up to about 14 anywhere from 13.8 up to 14.5 uh, uh, not higher than 15, it shouldn't be higher than that but we're gonna take a look at this and see if that's gonna jump now as you saw there the voltage actually dropped instead of going up to about 14 so we know the alternator is not charging um, most of the times the problem is going to be your alternator in fact not the alternator itself but the voltage regulator that's mounted on the back of the alternator here you have the alternator on the back you're going to have this voltage regulator and what happens is that uh, these uh, regulators have the brushes they make contact there and then those wear out over time in some models you can just replace that and you'll be fine but you never know now before you do replace the alternator keep in mind that the problem might be a couple other things as well uh, if your alternator your mercedes alternator is not charging could be a couple other issues that we see uh, one of them is there's a fuse basically to the back of the alternator you have the positive that comes right here this uh, there's a fuse typically that protects that circuit it's always it should always be live so if you can actually reach to the back of your alternator uh, this has a cap that goes on it but you can pull that cap from underneath and then connect your voltmeter you should still see 12 volt if you don't see 12 volt then your problem might not be the alternator the problem could be that fuse and there's a fuse box typically under the passenger foot well for most of these Mercedes but it depends on the model it could be somewhere else as well the other issue if you are getting 12 volt here you end up replacing the alternator of course of course keep in mind sometimes if you get aftermarket uh, alternators they might not be compatible and it might not work but uh, one other thing that we sometimes see is that the ECU so the ECU is what controls the voltage regulator here and sometimes you might not get any signal coming to the regulator and therefore you're not getting any output from the alternator. So those are the two most common issues. 8 out of 10 is going to be your alternator or most likely the voltage regulator. But typically this is all, all replaced as whole unit. You can replace just the regulator. but. Uh, you never know like it could be the alternator too so it's just recommended to replace the whole unit but that's how you test it it's very simple you can use a voltmeter and you'll be able to tell if you're getting a charge uh, of course this car is not charging the battery light is on the red battery light if you have a white battery light don't rush and replace the alternator a lot of times there's a auxiliary or the secondary battery the white battery light on your dashboard but if you get in the red battery light then you most likely have an issue with charging system so that's it thank you for watching